Hey everyone, so I know right now I'm not wearing makeup, but I plan to do a tutorial right after this. Um, it is Canada. I live in Canada. It is Canada. You better know that. <laughs> uh, anyways, so I live in Canada and um, it is dark right now. It's like 5 o'clock and it's a little depressing. Um, but it gets dark around 4.30. But yeah, I went to the dollar store today and I, because I have a, um, um, a sculpture project for art class that I have to do and so I needed to buy a couple things at the dollar store so I'm going to give show you a little dollar store haul even though it's not technically makeup related I still think it's going to be fun one thing I'm not going to show you is like these gloves that I just kind of paid for for my stepdad and if you see me kind of poke or look at the screen funny or kind of like poke it it's because my dad is like texting me a lot and I'm just like trying to close the tweet or not the tweet the text so yeah, so I'm building a house basically for art class, for a sculpture, and so I bought a few like materials for that. So my stepdad is really handy with like kind of stuff like that, like he has a really creative mind which is awesome. So he, I bought, like keep in mind these things were like a dollar each. I bought these like wooden dowels, they're really small and nice like that, and I bought three packs, you get 20 per pack, and this is going to be like our framing for the house. And then... One thing about the dollar store that I really don't care for is that they just chuck anything in random bags. So like if you have like three different bags, like there's like just everything in every single bag. Anyway, so as our joints for the, um, I don't know, I'm just going to get a little bit more organized here. That way I only have to rustle through one bag. Okay, so as like our little joints for the house, we picked up these like little styrofoam balls. So you picked up two packs of the smaller ones, and you get 12 per um, pack here. And then we picked up the bigger ones, so you can see the difference here, and you get 10 per pack. So I don't know how we're actually going to put it together right now. I still, have to, I still have to draw out a plan or something, but he's going to help me with that, which I'm really excited for because it's, like, it's technically due tomorrow, but I told my teacher that I probably, probably wasn't going to be finished because... Um, I was working on my other thing that's due on in two days from now and no one else has even started it and I'm almost done. So and like that was like a sign back in September and it's due December 8th. And it's just ridiculous that they're not even close to being done. So like my teacher has kind of like i un been understanding about that, like the fact that I'm almost done my pencil portfolio, that's what it's called. And no one else has started. So then, to decorate the actual inside of the house, I bought a whole bunch of rhinestones. These were $1.25 each. And these are like the blue and green ones. Then I bought like the purple and pink ones. And then I just bought like the orangey, yellowy brown ones. So yeah, I'm really excited to use that to decorate. And the other thing... I think that's, oh yeah, no, then I bought these little, um, because I bought a hot glue gun somewhere. I think I dropped the bag somewhere. Oh well, I bought a hot, oh no, it's right here. I bought a hot glue gun. So at, at the, I bought the hot glue gun at Walmart, but let me just try to fix the camera a little bit better here. There. Okay, so, whoa. So I bought a hot glue gun, so I wanted to buy some glue sticks for it. Even though I bought the glue gun after. But then, to make sure, then I bought my stepdad, like, this little twistable alarm clock for his, my dad. My stepdad drives transport. He owns his own little business company there. Um, he owns his own transport company, which is semi, I don't know what, you, what everyone calls it, but we call it transports. Um, in the States, they call it semis or big rigs, 18-wheelers, all of that. That's what he drives. Let me just call it transport in Canada. Anyway, so he needed a new alarm clock. So you, sometimes you have to wake up early. Well, you can see like the reflection from my camera. And so yeah, I just bought them that. Anyway, so I bought those glue, glue sticks for the glue gun. But then when we were at Walmart, this glue gun... It's my dad again. The glue gun was like $4 for this cute little thing. But my stepdad said, just to make sure that we don't... Um, that we buy like the right ones. Just, I picked up another pack. So this time... So I have like, and I, they ended up being the same size anyways, so now we have two packs instead of one, which is kind of good. And that's it for Walmart. 
So I'll go back to the dollar store haul now. The rest of it is just stuff that's for me. Of course. <laughs> so, um, I bought this little mesh, like, little container thing. Just, it's like one of those pencil holders. I'll probably put some brushes or something in it. Um, and it was a dollar twenty-five. My dollar store is not like an actual real dollar store because of the economy now. But I know there's another dollar store in like my city, like in Canada really, um, that it's like not even a dollar store. You can't even go there with five dollars and walk out with literally anything. It's like a buck or twenty. It's like it's a dollar or twenty, you know. And this dollar store is like a dollar. Maximum I've ever seen in there was two dollars, so that's pretty good. And then I just bought like the mini version of that. It's just, it doesn't have a lid. It's just like this little packaging thing that's on it. Let me take it off. And this was a dollar. If it's not, if there's nothing like, if there's no, ugh, if there's no mark, ugh, price marked on it, then that means it's just a dollar. Otherwise here, it's, there's a, a marked price. So you know that it's not a dollar. It's a dollar twenty-five. Anyway, so I just bought this little mini one just to fit in my little drawer. And after I, oh, that's nice. Look, it has like a little foam bottom. So is this one. That's so cool. Anyway, so I bought these to help organize my makeup space. And once I do that, I'm going to do that right after this video. Um, I'm going to do a makeup organization and collection video. And that might be in two parts because my phone won't allow me to upload videos more than 10 minutes long. Even though YouTube does, my phone won't. So, yeah. I'm stuck with like the old... Um, <clears throat> method of 10 minutes, 10 minutes. But I'm hoping to try and get it within that 2 10 minute slots. And then, next I bought, whoa, I picked up 3 rolls of this. I thought I only picked up 2. Oops. Oh well. This is like self-adhesive magnets. So you can see like there's like the little sticker and there's the magnet part. And apparently, I thought I only picked up 2 rolls of this. But apparently it's three and the reason I bought this was because I know that you have to use it when you depot your own MAC shadows and I don't have a MAC palette yet however I'm planning on putting them in this little thing here which is just like an empty mark palette that I have and but they don't stick to that like they fall off like they fall out so that's why I bought those. <clears throat> and then, second last, I bought this little desk organizer thing. And I bought this mainly to hold my palettes. Because I have, like, well, I have the Mark palette, I have the 120 palette, and then I have a Le Elf palette. So I bought this to hold up those. So I think that'll be nice. And this was $1.25. There we go. And like this thing is just like so simple and cheap and like, but it's like a pretty good quality. Like it is kind of bendable, I guess, but it's like on the bottom, it's really, really sturdy. Like I don't think it'll ever break or anything like that. Then last but not least is the only beauty related product that I ever bought and I bought it from the dollar store. They were $1.50, but oh well. And it is eyelashes. This is my first pair of eyelashes and that's why I bought it from the dollar store. Um... Because I didn't want to spend money on, like, you know, like a pair of lashes that maybe I'm not good at applying them myself or whatever. So, that's why I did this. So, I'm going to be filming a look later on tonight. I'm going to probably use these. So, I'm pretty excited for that. So, stick around for that and I will see you all later. Bye, everyone.